to be honest, I didn't really have a choice. My dad played, my uncle played, we were a very kind of rugby family. Um, so I was six months old in a full England kit with a ball bigger than me watching England play on the telly. So I think it was pretty much what I was doing with my life. <laughs> Yeah, it was such an amazing experience. Obviously, you've got all this pressure on yourself and it's really scary and daunting. And then you think, oh, it's just another rugby game. Like, you're absolutely fine. Um, my first cap was actually against the army in probably the worst weather conditions I've ever played in. Um, but yeah, it was such an amazing opportunity and that was under Joe as well. So it's really nice how things have linked back around and I can work with her again. Oh, do you know what? I've got a little bit of a tradition. Every Friday night, me and Sherma have spaghetti bolognese without fail, every Friday. Love it, love it. Um, to be honest, it's a bit like a marriage without being a marriage. Um, yeah, I think the only time we actually get away from each other is when we go to work during the day. But you know what, I wouldn't have it any other way. Like, hand on heart, she's been my rock through lockdown as well and we get on so well. Obviously come to training, we go home from training if we need to rant about anything we do and then we go to bed, start again in the morning. So it's nice to have that support away from the club as well as at the club. Um, so yeah, I, would, I wouldn't want to live with anyone else.